Mark, um, engagement, user growth, do you have any confidence that Bitly shares sort of indicate which way things are trending on either or both? Uh, absolutely. So at Bitly, we work with thousands of marketers around the world to help them improve performance on social and get insights into what's working and not, and not working. We're tracking more than 8 billion clicks a month across every platform from uh, regular users all the way to the biggest brands in the world. So we see a tremendous amount of insights in there that we think might be uh, leading, good leading indicators. So, so what are you seeing? Uh, who, who's growing quickly? Facebook, Twitter, who's growing faster? So the, the, the Bitly data is really interesting for third quarter over second quarter. There's a couple of things really jump out. The first is the continued dominance of Facebook. Facebook at, at scale and to have the growth that it's having quarter over quarter, particularly in mobile, they're a machine. Uh, and the data supports that. It's incredibly, incredible how fast they've been accelerating their growth and grabbing share and overall click volume. Facebook might be a machine, but I'm looking here, Facebook's desktop users alone, twice the size of Twitter all in. But we've been talking this quarter about how Twitter's user boy base is really being refined as sort of the news junkie base, and those are people who use Bitly more. Are you seeing that refining of the audience? Well, we see continued growth for Facebook and mobile, but they've always, um, Twitter and mobile, but they've always been predominantly mobile first. They actually saw a little bit of desktop growth quarter over quarter, which was interesting. The, what we found particularly interesting and telling for Twitter uh, in Q3 was an increase in click volume and share from Bitly Brand Tools customers. So our subscription product, which the best marketers like Geico and Pepsi and GE and Nike all use to help improve their performance to get insights, F Twitter's gaining share in that market. And that's really a good sign for them, I think, on their focus on advertising. Mark, Facebook being a monster in terms of sending media traffic is a story that everybody's been following for a while. Is Twitter still relatively insignificant? I mean, I, as a publisher, I still think it's relatively insignificant. Are there other emerging platforms? Are you seeing WhatsApp? Are you seeing email? Is there something with AOL or Yahoo? If you're a public markets investor, what other companies are you seeing activity on? Uh, we're seeing uh, strong growth in B2B with LinkedIn. And LinkedIn's doing a really nice job at building out their publishing platform. Uh, I think you're an influencer on LinkedIn too, John. So uh, you can see that data there. Uh, LinkedIn's doing a really good job of reaching the B2B audiences.